Bad press has surrounded agricultural producers in Idaho after undercover video of animal abuse was released on a dairy farm. Now Gem State farmers are hoping to turn that image around, opening their operations to our cameras. Jake Milder has more. The undercover video sparked outrage and concern, both for animal welfare and the privacy of businesses. It resulted in the legislature creating a law that criminalizes capturing video or photos without a farmer's consent. But a CUNA dairy man says the new law doesn't mean his work is secret. Cows got to eat and the cows got to be milked. John Wind Jr. owns and operates Liberty Ranch, a few miles southeast of CUNA. The family operation milks 2,600 cows every day. Wind often gives tours of his operation. I think it's important for the consumer to trust what I'm doing for him. And um, I can only represent Liberty Ranch, but hopefully... You know, this is a positive light for the industry as a whole. When he saw the disturbing video of animal abuse, the dairyman's reaction was clear. I show my employees a video, say, hey, look, dude, this, this is unacceptable. Twice a day, cows come into the milking barn. Laborers attach vacuum pumps to the udders, and milking begins. You can't come in here and look at a milker, oh, he's just a milker on a dairy. That's not true. He's a professional at what he does. Wynn takes care to hire quality farmhands and ensures they meet his expectations. All of our employees sign a pledge working here when they get employed here to abide by my standard. He says if anyone causes harm to an animal, they are fired on the spot, a step he has never had to take. I feel I have the best hired help I could possibly have. Great group of guys. The dairy produces more than 200,000 pounds of milk every day. Their product is used only by Sorrento Lactalis out of Nampa for their cheese. In studio, Jake Melder, today 6 on your side.